Ibom State um, in City, we get the opportunity to hear of um, developments in the IT sector, ICT sector. We hear of the um, things that are happening in our neighbors, get the opportunity to network, to share experiences, and to be able to meet um, various stakeholders who we can engage to assist us in our own ICT program here in St. Vincent Because the theme this year is about 21st century government. Um, it allows us um, in the government here in St. Vincent to let city you our neighbors, the wider region, but maybe more importantly, our people know how we are using ICTs in government to make us more effective, to make us more efficient in delivering services to our citizens. It gives us an opportunity also to understand that we have a long way to go. One of the early ones that um, has gotten a claim internationally, and we don't speak about much, is a citizen application management system that was introduced at the Citizen by Investment Unit so that people anywhere in the world can make an application under the CBI program for citizenship. And when they enter that into this online application, their applications can be monitored, can be managed from the beginning to the end, so you can see where it is, where it was. And it has made a remarkable change in the efficiency of our citizenship program. Prior to when we came, people um, had sometimes more than 100 days, 120 days, 150 days to get responses on applications. We have advertised that you have it 90 days. We know so we can do it in 25 days. And you can that that is including due diligence um, and so forth. So the efficiencies that have been improved in terms of CIO has done significantly, partly because of we have this ICT innovation that is brought in. Brought in. Generally speaking, um, we see the ICT infrastructure as critical to national development, to nation building. It, it helps our citizens have a better way of life, to make for good, for social interaction, as well as for economic development, where people find ways how to make money, see opportunities in small businesses, whether it is in delivering food, People can order food online and have it delivered. I had learned a few years ago that we did about say, $10 million worth of cut flowers and imported into St. Kitts every year. Now what does that mean? If I'm a young farmer, why can't I start to invest in flowers? Our hotels, our restaurants, there are different businesses that require fresh flowers every day. And if I can grow them and provide them, I can get some import substitution and create a business. So that the, the compilation and come back to the 21st century government, if we do this and we make ourselves online uh, and digitize our information, so it's easy to collate it.